Hey y'all, hey y'all, it's DJ the Diva coming at you with another video. You guys, um, this is a quick DIY video and I just wanted to share with you guys. First of all, if you have not yet subscribed to the channel, please do so. Become part of the most encouraging, caring, kind, uplifting, positive channel on YouTube. That's right here with DJ the Diva. So smash that subscribe button. It costs you absolutely nothing. Just scrap, smash that subscribe button and hit that notification bell so every time we upload a video that you are the first to be notified that we have done so. All right, give your girl a thumbs up so the channel can grow, go, and glow, okay? And drop me a comment in the comment section to let me know that you rock with me like I rock with you. And to let me know, uh, drop me a comment if you like the video that you've seen and what other things you'd like to see me do or if you want to collab or whatever you want to do. Now today is October the 17th at 7.20 a.m. Uh, you know, your girl's a working girl. So on the weekends when I'm working and I'm and I'm doing my DIYs, I have to do them early so I can get out the door and go do the things that makes me make my coin, okay? Um, so today's DIY involves spray paint. 96 cent from Walmart. I am spray painting some chargers that I'm going to use for the holiday. So the reason why I told you the date is because you really won't see this video until uh, mid to late November when I do my house tour for the holidays, okay? But I bought the chargers for 15 cents, a dime and a nickel, 15 cents a piece. I have seven of them. They're deep burgundy with some sparkle in it. Um, with a, a black cast or undertone underneath them and I want them white white okay so you know I need them white white so I can create my winter wonderland so I took them outside I put them on old shopping bags and I've given them three coats that took one can okay so a little uh, one can will go a long way. I did purchase three because they're so dark. I do uh, the top and the underside because a lot of times what I do is I will turn the charger over so that my um, dinnerware will be uh, elevated, you know, gives it a different different look, a different vibe, okay? And, uh, so, in saying that, it is 46 degrees out there. So I've been doing really light coats so that it will dry because when it's cold outside, it's harder to get your spray paint and stuff to dry, which is why I recommend always before you keep track of your weather in your area, what the weather is, the temperature is supposed to be. Um, I usually, by now, my all my decor outside is in place example lights lights or solar lights that have to have the stakes in the ground because the ground hardens as it gets cold uh the lights that you hang for christmas decor and stuff um yeah now's the time to go ahead and get that done um mine are done like i said i do the fairy lights and my shrubs and stuff so that's in place all I have to do is add the batteries when it comes time to light it up you know and I'm DIYing a reef that I'm gonna put on my door and that is the extent of well no it's not the extent I am doing another DIY for my porch decor but I had to spray paint some items, but that's already done. So you guys stay tuned for that. I'll do a DIY video to show you guys how I achieved that look also. Um, but that's a separate video. So, and just saying that it's easier when the weather is still nice to hang your lights and stuff. You don't have to light them up right away. That's not what I'm saying. Just have them in place. So when it's the temperature doesn't call for it, whether it's raining or snowing or windy or whatever in your area, your stuff is already in place and all you have to do is plug it in, add your batteries or what have you, okay? 
So like I said, I gave um, I gave my charger three coats. And I want to take you guys outside so you can see that. After it dries, it's going to take a little while because it is cool out here. But after it dries, I am going to turn them over. Do the exact same thing on the other side. You see that? The red is still coming through, and that's after three coats. But after um, it dries, I'm going to take it, turn it over, do the other side, let that dry for a few hours. And then I'm going to bring them in. And I got some um, acrylic white paint from the Dollar Tree, and I'm going to mix my shimmer in with that and go over so you see you'll no longer see any of the red um i was debating on whether to make this a two-part video but i'm just giving you the details so i don't have have to make a two-part video i just want to make one and you'll see the end result at my home tour um so my christmas home tour my holiday home tour so stay tuned for that well you by the time you see this video, you will already have seen that video. And this will just be an explanation of all the DIYs. So, I've done videos as I've done my DIYs so that you guys will know how I achieved the look that I achieved. And practically how much it really cost me. Like I said, those chargers I found at the Goodwill outlet. They were 15 cents a piece and... I'm redoing them. Um, spray paint, 96 cents at Walmart. I got three cans. Um, I don't know if I'm going to be using three, all three cans because uh, the one can got me three coats on the one side. So I'll probably do the other side and then go in with my acrylic paint. Um, I got my uh, glitter. It's the white glitter. And I got that from Walmart for $2.98. Uh, the acrylic paint at the Dollar Tree is a dollar. I got two of those. Um, so yeah, that is my DIY for this weekend. But I just want to say, you know, you can take something inexpensive with a little bit of damage, like those had scratches and whatnot, and make it over to something that you absolutely love. Something that would rival uh, the modern things that are in the store these days that are a little bit pricey. Now, I've seen white ones with the glitter in it at Home Goods, and they were $12.99. Uh, those are a good size charger. They're 14 inches. So, yeah. Okay. I love you to life. If you have not yet subscribed, please do so by smashing that subscribe button. Share my video with your friends, family, loved ones, and followers. We got to encourage and lift each other. And um, give me a thumbs up so the channel can go, grow, and glow. <laughs> we need to grow the channel, okay? I got over 500 videos. It's time for the channel to grow. So I appreciate your support. I so appreciate you sharing my videos and my channel with uh, people you know and your subscribers. Uh, I will do the same. Uh, at me when you do one of my DIYs or one of my cooking recipes or what have you. And I will greatly appreciate, appreciatively mention you in my videos and give you a personal shout out. Leave me a comment to let me know if there's something you want me to try out, do, or if there's a place you want me to shop at to take you along that a store you haven't been to or you just want to see what's in my area i will gladly do that too um yeah i love you guys to life act blessed talk blessed walk blessed and be a blessing to who be a blessing to the lord by blessing somebody else i rock with you like you rock with me i love you to life and have a blessed blessed day i don't know what day or a weekend or a weekday you're watching this but always be blessed from my heart to yours. This is DJ the Diva, and I'm out. Bye.